The team over at Suno AI recently released version 3 of their generative AI music system. This is really cool, and as you know, I've covered this a lot in the past, and I've shown you how to do things like extend your shortened tracks all the way to full-length songs, as well as adding different tags to control how the music actually turns out. You can check those videos out in this playlist, but let's see what's new in version 3. Let's we'll start with the official blog post where Suno talks about this model being able to produce radio quality music. V3 enables you to make full two minute songs in seconds and is available to all users. So regardless of if you have a paid plan or not, I don't have one personally, you can still use version three. It's open to everybody, which is really cool. It's also a lot faster at generating songs than version two was. Now, when you scroll down and we can take a look at the features and improvements, and it says better audio quality, so we should have better fidelity, more styles and genres, improved prompt adherence, including fewer hallucinations and more graceful endings. One of the big complaints was the endings of the songs. You couldn't really get an outro that made a lot of sense. And then prompt adherence is always a welcome thing. If you put in a prompt, you want the song to follow and have the same style that you wanted. So this should all be welcome changes, but let's take a look at how it actually works in practice. Now with this, Suno also rolled out these profiles. So you can go to suno.com slash at all your tech AI to check out some of the songs that I ended up putting up here. And one of them is one that I use in the outros of all of my videos. Now this one I generated with version two of Suno, but I think it's a good baseline. So let's take a look at that. All your tech AI earning the renown. All your tech AI streaming in your room. Dropping technology, making your mind. I actually really love how this one came out. That's why I use it in all of my videos. I took those same lyrics, and you can see the lyrics over here on the right-hand side, and I dropped those in to see what it does with version three for the same song, essentially. And let's see what that came up with. Throwing in code in the YouTube lane, spitting out tech wisdom never the same. In a world of ones and zeros I navigate, talking 3D prints, making them resonate. Home automation doors that self-operate, self-driving dreams I articulate. I'm the virtual. And one of the first things I noticed about the V3 songs is it seems like it has a higher sampling rate, a little bit higher fidelity than the V2 songs. The other thing is the voice, the actual vocals in the song, in the track, sound a lot crisper, a lot clearer than they did before. Now, I don't quite like the rap style in this one. It's a little too slow for me, especially compared to what we had in the original version two song, but it does kind of showcase that they've come a long way as far as audio clarity. So let's do a couple more examples and just check this out. And to do that, what we're gonna do is we're gonna jump over to the create tab. Now, instead of putting in my own lyrics like I did with this one before, we're gonna just have it create a new song of its own style. So I'm going to say, create a rap song about a YouTube channel that creates content about artificial intelligence called All Your Tech AI. You'll notice I put a.i. in there specifically because I've noticed that if I don't, about 50% of the time, it just says I instead of AI. So I just want to kind of set this up for success straight away. Now, the other thing you can do in V3 is you can do just straight instrumentals. So if you turn on this instrumental tab, It'll just produce an instrumental instead of a song with lyrics. The other thing is in this drop down, you can select version two or version three. So you could conceivably do a side by side comparison of the two as well on your own. So here's our first two songs. It took about 20 seconds to generate both of them, which is pretty awesome. It's a lot faster than version two was in general, and it called it binary rhymes. Blow your mind like a virtual frame From neural networks to deep learning We rock the stage Bringing the future Engaging brains on this digital page uh -huh. Step into a world where machines meet the human mind We'll blow you away Rewind like a tape that's been spliced All your Not bad, let's take a look at another one here Welcome to all your tech Where AI is the game We crack the code and blow your mind Like a virtual flame From neural networks to deep learning We rock the stage Bringing you the future Engaging brains on this digital page. I actually really like these. It's a lot better than what you'd get out of version two, just right off the bat. All right now, it, assuming that you love one of these songs, it's really easy to just click extend like you did before. It gives you this area to enter your lyrics. And then you can select a couple of different things here, which is really cool. This extend from, you didn't have this before. So you can extend from a specific time in the song. So if you didn't want to go from the very end, Maybe you wanted to go halfway through. There was some really compelling part 
you can select that and then you can continue the song from there. You can also select version three or version two from this drop down down here and just choose how you want this to be actual styled. Click continue and that's gonna extend the song and you can create a full song just like you did before. One of the things I wanna test though is it wasn't very good at outros, the actual endings of songs previously and that's something that they called out in the release notes that it should be better at now. So I'm gonna create a custom song and we're gonna go all the way through start to finish see how it does. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump over to create and then go into custom mode so we can paste our own lyrics. Now I've already got the lyrics from my All Your Tech AI song. So we'll go ahead and start with that. Now we're going to jump up and delete this last chorus part because it's not going to get to that in this first section. So now we've got verse one, verse two in the first chorus. That's all good. We're going to do the style of music, upbeat rap, not going to give it a title and we're just going to click create. Let's give these two a listen. Yo, pulling up in this digital domain. All your tech AI, remember the name, flow in the code. I like the flow of the rap over that, but I did like that intro. It had a nice beginning part and then as soon as the kind of beat dropped a little bit, it got right into the rapping. So I actually really like the way it did the intro. I'm just not a fan of the cadence of the rap over this particular beat, but let's have a listen to the other one. Yeah. Booting up in this digital domain. All your tech AI, remember the name. Flowing in code in the YouTube lane. Spitting out tech wisdom, never the same. In the world of ones and zeros, I navigate. Talking 3D prints, making them resonate. Home automation, doors that self operate. Not bad. I still don't love the cadence of the rap, so let's create another one. And this is kind of the point here, right? You're going to have this sort of back and forth, especially when you're just auto creating it where you're gonna have to select that first track, you're gonna have to do this a couple times, iterate through it, get that first track, that first section of track really on point. And then once you do that, when you click extend, it's gonna carry that through for the rest of the song. So it's really important that you get that first part just how you like it. Yo, booting up in this digital domain. All your tech AI, remember the name. Flowing in code in the YouTube lane. Spin Not quite. Yo, booting up in this digital domain. All your tech gave the name. Flowing in code in the YouTube lane. Spitting out tech wisdom, never the same. In a world of ones and zeros, I navigate. Talking 3D prints, making them resonate. Home automation doors that self-operate. Self-driving dreams are articulate. I'm the virtual prophet in the tech town. Breaking down AI. It's not bad. Yo, booting up in this digital domain. All your tech AI, remember the name. Flowing in code in the YouTube lane. Spitting out tech wisdom, never the same. In a world of ones and zeros, I navigate. Talking 3D prints, making them resonate. Home automation, doors that self-operate. Self-driving dreams I articulate. I'm the virtual prophet in the tech town. Breaking down AI, wearing the crown. From basics to complex, never let you down. All your tech AI, earning the renown. Living in your room, dropping tech knowledge. Making your mind bloom. From the screen to the world, watch me soon. In the digital universe, I'm the boom. Yo, back again with another tech lesson. All your tech AI, teaching you the essence. Coded in Python in the YouTube session. Showing you the tricks, never the regression. In the world of data and algorithms, I educate. Talking neural networks, making them demonstrate. Natural language images that generate. Reinforcement, learning agents that innovate. Not bad. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to extend that one. So we'll click on extend. And then we need to grab our rest of our lyrics. Because remember, we just have down to the end of the second verse. So now we'll just go ahead and paste in the rest of our song here. And you can see we've got end song, we've got an outro, and then we've got just the chorus. Because we've already got verse one and two in there. So we'll go ahead and click extend, continue. Let's check them out. To my channel, hit like and subscribe. All your tech AI, come along for the ride. Interesting. That one didn't pick up the chorus at all, but it did. It did do the outro, and then it has this kind of like nice little long outro at the end. But let's check out the other one. To my channel, hit like and subscribe. All your tech AI, come along for the ride. It actually did have a legit outro there. 
you'll notice it even at the very end faded on that last couple notes that it dropped. That's pretty cool. Much, much, much better than what it used to do before. Uh, I still don't love this song too much. I need to go back through and iterate over it a couple more times, get it just how I like it, maybe change up the rap style a little bit, even modify some of my lyrics. But this does have better prompt adherence. It does have higher audio quality. And it does actually do outros finally. Not a bad deal. And you can still use this completely for free. You get new generations, new credits each and every day. So you can come in here, create a couple songs, mess around with it, and you don't have to pay for a pro plan. Now, if you want to use it commercially, you still need a pro plan and all of those things. Not a bad update from the Suno team. Be sure to check out my other videos on the subject, especially if you want to create extended songs or see some of those other special tags you can add to control the way your music comes out. Otherwise, we'll see you next time. Thank you all so much. I'm the virtual prophet in the tech town. Break it down, AI, wearing the crown. From basics to complex, never let you down. All your tech, AI, earning the renown.